Racism is not for debate. It wasn't the way Brown University's Taubman Center for Public Policy expected New York City Police Commissioner Ray Kelly's lecture to go. Ultimately, Kelly's appearance only lasted about 25 minutes. Brown Jr. Connor McGuigan was there. The room that Ray Kelly was actually in, uh, by about once the lecture started, it became clear that that room was almost 50 percent full with people who planned to protest and stop the lecture. Despite the university's best efforts to keep the lecture going, you let him speak and you make your comments as part of the question and answer. Brown University officials eventually had to end the speech and clear the room to calm the situation down. Protests got more and more loud and frequent as time went on and at a certain point at about 4.30. Uh, Bray Kelly had not said pretty much more than two sentences the whole time. And the protest wasn't just inside. Brown University student Atal Shatner Elmale snapped this photo of the outdoor demonstration. They were uh, chanting uh, stop police brutality. The university's president was less than impressed with the protest. Christina Paxton told NBC 10 the actions prevented any exchange of ideas and deprived the campus and the Providence community of an opportunity to hear and discuss important social issues. In Providence, Julie Tremel, NBC 10 News, The Night Team.